Now I made a short video about practicing a piece of Baroque music along with the percussion on GarageBand to encourage that sort of rhythmic delineation of those faster things, getting your sort of even phrasing and even semiquavers in both hands. Now, there's a grade three piece that's just about to go out of syllabus, but it's by Dmitry Kamilevsky and it's called Clowns and it does something like this. Now, what we don't want it to sound like is a clown that turns up to your kid's party stinking of booze. We don't want this. We don't want that. We need it to be really... We need it to be even and to have real rhythmic strength. Now, to do that, we need to make sure that those semiquavers in the right hand are even. And we also need to make sure that the left hand, those bass notes, line up exactly with those notes, with the right hand ones. Now, going back to the metronome idea, that's fine, we can do it with a metronome, but what about, and this is where I rattle some cages, <laughs> is to program a little bit of reggae. Reggae, okay. So, uh, Dmitry Kabalevsky and reggae, uh, they kind of don't really, they're not really synonymous. However, I think that the rhythmic intent of Dmitry Kabalevsky and the rhythmic intent of Lee Scratch Perry are very similar. So I've got a little track here which I'm going to play to, and it's made up of some drums, some percussion, a bass, and a, a couple of other keyboard sounds. It goes a bit like this. section that goes that goes into F and F minor but that's fine that's fine now the basically the intent here is that you can really get to grips with the beat with what's happening now as I said before in the last video you don't want to go go thinking this when you're playing the, the piece you don't really want to be playing it as a piece of reggae that's not the point of what I'm trying to say what I'm saying is that if you start to inject really fine rhythms in terms of the sort of speed of the notes that you're hearing in the background in order to line your notes up that's really what I mean it's getting the fact that you've got the that you can really line those things up and actually the the inflections of this reggae thing here if I was to just go into the uh, the drums only just listening to the drums on their own Those hi-hats actually line up with the notes that you're playing anyway. It just makes perfect sense. And it also means that you've got something that's, yeah, you can have a bit of fun at the same time as working on getting your even your notes nice and even. Music is meant to be fun. As soon as it stops being fun, it's kind of, then, you know, it's, don't do it anymore. But hopefully with something like this, you can make it much, much more fun. And actually you're engaging with something. I know it's a machine, but it's a very natural sounding machine, much different to a mechanical metronome where the spring is worn out and it's going. So it's, you know, you don't want that. You want something that you can play to and have a bit of fun with. It's always important to think of music as, I mean, there have been 
many, many very poor attempts at linking the sort of classical world, if you will, and modern sort of rock and pop, you know, hooked on classics or switched on classics. And he sort of listens to them and go, Ooh. But when you think about what Jacques Lussier managed to do to J.S. Bach's music, I grew up thinking that that air on a G-string was, in fact, a composition by that. The, you know, I thought it was a jazz piece, but no. That was when I was seven or eight, and then I heard the Bach version of it, and I thought, hang on, is this the original? Oh, it's the original. So, you know, I have, I have a mate that um, who grew up thinking that the Beatles were a Mantovani tribute band. Um, you know, it's there are so many different ways of doing, of playing music, of playing a piece. I mean, you could play this as a swing tune, for example, but for purposes of learning clowns, that Kabanaski piece, as it's meant to be played, you could use GarageBand. <laughs> 